Hello everyone. Today we're going to be performing our water separation demonstration between our new industrial series system with our extreme water separator and a competitor system, which this system is also designed for class eight and heavy duty applications. Now we're going to be contaminating some diesel fuel, running them through both systems, and we're gonna see which one performs better at water separation. Now let's get started. So you can see for yourself that we're not manipulating the competitor's filters in any way. We're going to be removing them from the plastic wrap and installing new filters, the same as on our system. The center cylinder here is just filled with number two diesel fuel right out of the pump here in Marthasville, Missouri. And what we're going to do, I'm going to be putting in some water, kicking on a standalone fuel pump that we have on here. And what that's going to do is turn the water from free water at the bottom to emulsified water where it blends in with the fuel and becomes very cloudy. That's actually more difficult to separate out of the fuel than free water. Okay, we'll just do a little time lapse here because I like to let this run for a few minutes and really get that fuel blended. Okay, now that the fuel and water have blended together nicely and the water has now become an emulsion in the diesel fuel. I'm going to go ahead and power off our blender pump here and then I'm just going to connect our fuel lines which will show you the fuel line uh, routing later in the video so you can see it's not manipulated and then we're going to power each system on, prime them and then you'll see as the fuel begins pumping you'll be able to visually tell there will be a drastic difference in how pure and clean the fuel is over here on the fast side and how dirty and contaminated the fuel will be on the competitor side. Prime each system individually here. If you notice, this system is much quieter too. Might be a little bit hard to tell on the video. Okay, both systems are primed. Now let's go ahead and get this test started. Now those test results absolutely speak for themselves. And that is the power of our extreme water separator. And like I said, it removes over 99% of the water that can be found in diesel fuel. Now in the competitor system, they actually just use a wire mesh media for their water separator, which is similar to the media that we use in our particulate filter. And that media is not at all effective at separating the water from diesel fuel, whether it's emulsified or free water. 
Now, on our particulate filter, the wire screen that we use, that is just to keep large debris out of the fast gear before it runs through our extreme water separator, removing the over 99% of the water and filtering out all other contaminants down to two micron, absolute. Now, which one of these fuels would you like to supply your fuel injection system with?